do it. Do it. Yeah, I like that. Boy, I do it. I do it. Maggie from Do 317 with your best bets for entertainment in Indianapolis this week. Brought to you by Indies Music Channel. This is Indianapolis's premier Santa extravaganza. For one thing, we're jollier than all the other elfin gatherings. Want to consort with gobs of like-minded, kind Santas as we pub crawl with Sugar Plum Authority about the finer establishments of historic Fountain Square? Indeed you do. This event is over 21, candy cane optional, and festive attire strongly encouraged. We'll begin at Imbibe and End of the Line, which are located in the Fountain Theater building at Prospect and Shelby Street. If you're looking for something out of the ordinary for the season, the Lost Christmas Eve is for you. This final entry in the Trans-Siberian Orchestra's rock opera trilogy is perhaps their most ambitious and complex in the series. The Lost Christmas Eve has been called a story of loss and redemption and features a diverse soundtrack fusing elements of rock, classical, folk, Broadway, and R&B. There are two showtimes, 3 p.m. and 7.30 p.m. See you there. Chef Neil Brown and the Libertine Liquor Bar are creating a special dinner of Appalachian Fair for you to enjoy. Expect snapping turtle soup, head cheese with sorghum, vinegar and apples, venison with mushrooms, chestnuts and coffee, as well as a few other surprises. For a small added fee, there will also be beverage pairings curated by sommelier Lindy Brown. Be sure to leave your pistols and rifles at the door, however, because the Libertine is a classy place and they won't tolerate no feuding. After dinner, the bar will stay open for reserved guests only, so you'll enjoy some sippin' whiskey, bourbon, or rye. $50 for dinner, so call for reservations. For more entertainment news, check out do317.com. I'm Maggie, keep it tuned to IMC Indies Music Channel for more music, news, and updates.